Hey, aloha guys, Eric West here, hawaiirealestate.org. Another warning came up from YouTube. Moderation keeps everybody safe. I don't have a moderator on my comments, so you guys just go to town. Whatever you want to say, just keep it safe. Keep it aloha, right? If you're new to the channel, my name is Eric West. I'm all about teaching you everything there is to know about Hawaii and its real estate, but you can't find it in the listing. I'm here to give you that inside information. I'd like to be your guy on Maui if you're ever in the market to buy or sell real estate, because I've been here, gosh, going on 12 years now and uh, kind of know the place pretty well and I'm happy to share what I do know. So tonight we're going to go for a quick evening walk here in the beautiful Kapalua. Now for you guys that come on vacation here, I know you know this walk, but we're going to talk about where we're at and what's going on around here. So this is obviously the lower road we call it. It's lower Honopi'ilani road and here we have the montage, the Kapalua Bay. We have the spa, which is where I'm going right now, Kapalua Bay Beach. Kapalua Villas Reception, the Ridge Villas, the Bay Villas, and the Golf Villas. Those are your three condominium complexes in Kapalua. And the Banyan Tree Restaurant, which is over here by the Ritz-Carlton. Matter of fact, I just ate there last night. It was very, very good, actually. And this is the world-famous Office Road, where you have the Cook Pines are lining both sides. It's like something out of, inspired by the, uh, maybe the Palace of Versailles. Very um, majestic, unique. Um, uh, what, what's the other word I'm looking for? It's very, um, kind of like organized. It's just very, it's just cool, man. It's cool. Up there we have the Ridge Villas. So all these uh, complexes, if you want to shout out anything in the comments, if this is one of your favorite places to stay, let me give you a quick walking tour here of Kapalua. Those are the Ridge Villas right there. And of course, all of these complexes, I'll put a link in the description of anything that's for sale. And the most recent sales, once the video posts. Of course, this is the Ritz-Carlton. Yes, they have uh, fee simple properties that you can purchase at the Ritz-Carlton. They do very well ROI. And in case you were ever wondering what these buildings are down here, those are the Ironwoods. Those are true second homes. You cannot vacation rent those. They are condominiums, however right there on Ironwoods Beach. Gorgeous, beautiful, exclusive, and expensive. But yeah, let's face it, everything in Kapalua <laughs> has a price yep. tag. As we all know, quality is remembered long after price is forgotten. Just a beautiful evening glow. Just a few seconds ago, I was having some technical difficulties with the the gimbal, the Wi-Fi, the microphone, you name it. Technology just comes and bites you right in the you-know-what when you least expect it. Actually, I've come to expect it. So if it doesn't bite me, that's when I'm like surprised. But anyway, <laughs> just a few minutes ago. Of course, right over here on the Bay Course, you can see right up there is Kumalani Chapel. Hit me in the comments if you hit their Sunday service while you're here vacationing. You can see the golfers are getting in their last-minute birdies or double bogeys. Just depends on how you're keeping score. <laughs> no, we never cheat in golf, man. That's the one rule, man. You gotta have ethics. That's where you learn a lot about a person. How they golf. It says a lot, man. It says a lot. Okay. Anywho, where was I? I'm gonna lose track. Look at these trees. Aren't these trees just cool? I don't know how they do it, but it's like so many plants and trees on Maui are like Dr. Seuss style. You know, right? Just something right out of Dr. Seuss. So many. Those trees are one of them. So the whole point of uh, my channel, well, there's a few different points, but one of the points is to sort of live vicariously. So maybe you're dealing with some extraordinary weather patterns. You're getting dumped on with lots of rain, snow, sleet, and or anything else that's super crazy annoying in the wintertime. And you just feel like having a walk through Kapalua, checking out the tennis courts there at the Ironwoods. Well, your buddy Eric is here to help for a little vicarious evening walk and the Maui Fix. So every once in a while when I can, I'll do my best to show you a beautiful sunset, to show you around the neighborhood, and maybe that'll help you plan your next vacation or possibly your next second home or if you're like me and you're thinking, I'd like one permanent vacation, you want to move here full time. Now I have not been on vacation, that's for sure, but 
I like to pretend. So by the way, this is a Kapalua place. This is a nice little gated community. Actually, probably the most expensive homes are right on the ocean here, wedged in between the Ironwoods and Kapalua Bay Villas. You can see the Bay Villas right there on the horizon. That's the Bay Villas, Kapalua place, single family homes, right on Ironwoods Beach. Very, what's the word I would use? Mac Daddy? <laughs> Gorgeous, epic, on the water, on the beach. And there we have a nice shot of Molokai. So if I wasn't doing a live, right, I would just be cruising and I'd be looking at Molokai. My jaw would drop. Then I would look down at the waves crashing at Ironwoods and I would think to myself, Eric, why are you not surfing right now? And the answer would be, because I'm trying to go to the gym. Believe it or not, the whole purpose of this is to get a quick workout in before the day's over. It's been a busy day here on Maui as always. Made a nice uh, offer on a condo. I don't always talk about my deals sometimes, especially before they're under contract because I don't want to create any undue competition for my buyers. But let's put it this way. We made an offer on a really good two bedroom vacation rental condo somewhere on the west side of Maui. Just hit the market, smoking deal. ROI is gonna be nuts. Hope we get it. Three offers were on the table on day one, which was today. Ours was the fourth and uh, I'll keep you posted if we get it or not, but it's been exciting. I like the thrill of the chase. I love the hunt. It's exciting. I like to win. I like to help my clients win. So let's hope for the best on this one. We used the secret strategy. So I'm sure it's going to work. But I'll let you know. Oh, hang on. Where's the button? There we go. Ah, we're back. Okay, so just continuing the Maui fix which is the Maui walk, vicariously walking as we gaze up to our left and look. Views are like from the Bay Villas. Of the three, Ridge Villas, Bay Villas, and Golf Villas, the Bay Villas, obviously, since they're on the ocean, have a premium price tag. And they have these views. And what's interesting about the Bay Villas is as you go up in the complex further back, the views kind of get bigger, higher, more panoramic in a lot of in a lot of ways. So that's one of my favorite things about some of these complexes is the oceanfront views are good too, but because there's theater style seating, they can get bigger and almost some would say better when you're higher up. And you pay a lot less if you're on the second or third row. So Bay Villas, again, just a review. Bay Villas to my right, Ridge Villas to my left. Now on this walk, we're not going to be able to see the golf villas, but they're up here over this, over this little hump right there. And then off in the distance is where I'm headed to, which is the Montage. If you haven't been tuning into the channel lately, I recently joined the spa. I've been telling my clients for years that the spa is the best spa in Maui, best gym facilities. And I guess I just finally decided to put my money where my mouth is, and decide to join. And the nice thing about that is it does give me and my clients, my guests, my family access to the pool that's at the front, the beach club pool. That's the premier membership. So if you ever come over to Maui and you want to hang out the, at the beach club, let me know. I'm game. Nice little shot, a little picturesque shot right here. Looking towards Molokai. Gorgeous, huh? So, quick story before I get to the montage spa. And I got to kick in a workout here in like 38 seconds. They close at 7. That's the only kind of negative thing. Boy, I'm really close up there. Sorry about that. Um, anyway, went out today with a, a client of mine, Luke. Aloha, Luke. Much aloha to you and your ohana. But we went out to swim with the whales. And so we went out this morning on some paddle boards and it was just dead calm. We're talking not a skiff of wind. It was like a lake glass. And we got out there. There was probably 25, 30 people out there on you know, canoes and six mans and one mans and paddle boards. It was like a convention. It was like a, 
you know, one tourist convention out there looking for the whales, and we saw lots of breaches. We didn't have a real close encounter, but um, it was still just a beautiful, epic, amazing, magical, mystical molecules of Maui moment moments hanging out together out there. And, and then it was funny, it's like, as soon as we got way too far out, you know, we're like probably a thousand yards out, the wind out of nowhere just kicks up. I mean, we're talking like serious. So then we had a battle back to the to the beach for like, oh, it took like an hour. And Luke, uh, I hope you're not too sore, man, but that was, that was kind of nuts, man. I was pretty tired myself. And then as I was going back, there was this thing, I don't know what it was. It was like aqua blue in the water in front of me, like the water is dark blue. And this thing was like reflecting like aqua blue and white. And I tried to catch up to it and it's, it went just a little bit faster than I did, but it wasn't like flying. I couldn't figure out what it was. I have some of it on GoPro, but if anyone's ever experienced that, some kind of aqua white creature about four or five feet under the water, just kind of cruising around. But I couldn't figure out what it was. I thought, is it a great white? Is it a dolphin? Is it a manta ray? But it looked like aqua. It looked like, um, uh, what's that What's that? Um, that, that the piece of jewelry? Um, that's, Ah, it's like beautiful aqua blue, but anyway, that's what it looked like. So if anyone has ever experienced that, I'd love to know. And here we are, guys, our final destination on this beautiful little Kapalua walk. Ah. The final destination at the Montage Kapalua Bay as the internet connection kicks in and kicks out over and over. A beautiful, beautiful property. I'm going to say the most premier hotel and property. I mean, this piece of real estate in and of itself is like unbelievable. And then this is what the entrance of the spa looks like. I love how they keep the fires burning. The fires at the Montage Spa. I can smell the eucalyptus and peppermint lavender infused air wafting out from the reception area <laughs> this is where I'm headed guys I want to say thank you so much for tuning in I appreciate it as always it is a pleasure bringing you just little moments on Maui little Maui fix moments some photography some smooth video and just the trees the big massive beautiful shade trees that we have the towering palms and those moments of escape. So let me know in the comments what's your plan for the escape. Are you escaping here this winter? Are you going to come to Kapalua? Are you going to come to the spa? Because I'm telling you, this place, not only does your blood pressure drop, but I don't know, it just has a very um, pampering feeling. I'm going to say that word. It, it's pampering. It really is. <laughs> it's nuts. And it's just sometimes in life, I think we can get so blown out with stress and thinking and just working and doing and just going that to have a retreat like this is just so nice so not just a, a retreat like like the spa but a retreat like Maui a place that you can come and just unwind relax and just peer through the trees and look up at the sky and just take in something like just as simple as that and just find some peace and relaxation for your soul because that's what we need. Cortisol levels dropping, natural dopamine rising through natural, beautiful methods that are not drug or alcohol induced. I think that's the answer. Find out what it is that makes you tick naturally and intentionally create that space and time where you're just gonna chill out. Get the Maui energy, get the relaxation. You don't have to come here, but you can just intentionally decompress. And that's what I'm gonna go do. After I pump some iron, of course, because I got to keep the, you know, got to keep the guns gunning. But anyway, guys, thanks so much for tuning in. I'm sure the spa lady is like, what the heck is this guy doing? Talking to his, to his cell phone. <laughs> if you like the video, I'll love a thumbs up, a share. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And uh, much aloha to you guys. Till next time, Eric West. Out. Now we're done. Keep scraping the frost off the windshield just for a few more weeks. Okay, months. <laughs> Later, dude.